Hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I hope uh, everybody is doing awesome. So, um I'm happy to say that on April 8th, 2023 is when we landed first time in Canada. And as on today we have completed 1 year here and this video is all about sharing our experience, what are the phases that we gone through and how we are right now. So please stick around till the end of the video. Uh, one disclaimer I want to say that this is not going to be a informative video. This is more like an emotional video because that is how it will be even for you. Please give it a like if you like this video, and if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Okay, let's go. So the first and foremost feeling that I want to tell you is is truly the mixed feeling. right from you know when you start packing your stuff when you're like you know all your family members coming and meeting you all of your family members will be thinking you already have a good life here why are you going there that you're going for something better maybe so this mixed feeling is going to be there in your mind till the time you actually land and things change for you and then the second phase comes once you land in canada you will see that everything is new so it's going to be a feeling of lost you like you come and see it's like it's a completely different scenario like um, i mean it's a different country altogether and you don't know anybody yet and you you have you're at a stage where you're figuring out everything even right from buying a milk packet to groceries or home or anything job everything you're just feeling figuring it out the moment you come to canada be prepared that you have to walk really really long distances so once you figure out the basic things then comes the most important and obvious question finding a home for yourself we knew this is how we are going to do that we are going to stay in airbnb for 2 weeks and within the 2 weeks we'll find a something permanent place so finding a home is going to be a task for you which i'm sure you can understand so that's going to be another phase obviously in the next comes is the job because job is the most challenging aspect in canada even though on one side the opportunities are plenty equally the competition is also very high there are multiple openings that you will find but when you apply there are like thousands of people just like you applying for the same job this phase is going to probably bring you down for some time once you settle in in a permanent place let's say then comes the point of weather because you know canada climate is like very fluctuating now comes a phase where you are now getting used to the weather so adjusting to this weather will also become a problem for you especially of a child at home once all these problems are resolved and you give it another buffer of 3 to 4 months then comes a phase where you feel in canada you feel at home i have seen people losing hope i have seen people struggling i have seen people almost giving up because these things not for not everyone these things work out easily and touch wood we have for us it has worked out but some people do struggle and to them i want to say only one thing that you have to keep faith you have to keep patience because canada is actually a land of opportunities it will take at least a one year for all things to start out so you need to keep your patience that's all about the video like i said this is not like an informative video it's more like an emotional video and i hope you like this video and if you did give it a thumbs up consider subscribing to my channel okay have a nice day and enjoy bye